the reason we do continuous fed furnaces rather than batch fed furnaces is a, a batch fed furnace is solely dependent on the operator to get a consistent heat bar to bar, order to order. With a continuous furnace, it's up to the furnace. It's computer controlled. It knows what order we're working on. It knows what temperature it needs to be coiled at. It knows the time at which those bars need to spend in the furnace to get the right heat. That way you don't have any uh, issues with overheating, uh, with any kind of decarb that you could easily get with uh, a batch furnace, uh, you know, if the guy just doesn't come back in time. Uh, you also don't have any problems with the bars not being hot enough when you coil them. This furnace, not only is it monitoring the temperature of all the different zones in the furnaces, it also is monitoring the temperature of the actual bars. So when it's time for that first bar to be coiled, this furnace won't give it to the operator that's going to coil it until it's at the right temperature. Even if they manually try to feed the bar out, it won't give it to them. So you don't want the bar overheated in the furnace, but you also want it at a proper heat when you do coil it uh, so that it's hot enough to coil and hot enough when it goes into the quench.